Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? Today we are opening two of these Walmart exclusive Upper Deck 2023 Series 1 Mega Boxes that were on sale for Black Friday at 50% off. Definitely don't recommend picking these up for their normal price of like $52, but I believe these were 28 something before tax. I'll throw up the total price after tax up on screen now. So yeah, pretty excited for this. this. is the first retail that's released for Series 1 this year. Going to be getting 10 packs per mega box, 9 packs, so 2 Young Guns uh, with a 25% chance at a third Young Guns, as well as the bonus pack, which is a 1995 Rookie Die Cut bonus pack. So yeah, should be interesting here. If you guys are new, please consider subscribing. We're going to be doing a giveaway of 500 subscribers if we hit it before the end of the year. So please go ahead and subscribe. Drop a like on the video. It really helps me out a lot. And comment down below if you were able to get any of these mega boxes and how you did. There are some retail exclusive uh, parallels, I believe. I believe there's blue freestyles that are one in every other mega box. We'll be ripping up open two. So hopefully we get one of those blue freestyles. And yeah, let's get right into it. So here's a look at the packs. Interesting design. I like the blue a lot better than the, the black they got going on for Hobby. And then here's the die cut pack. We'll start with the die cut pack. Typically, because you can't really get a whole lot out of these, but I guess you never know. See what the die... Oh, there we go. Manny Beneers. That probably is the best one to get. I will definitely take that. Matt Boldy, another good one. So I don't know what the values in these are. And Lucas Reichel, definitely some solid die cuts there. All right, first pack. Really kind of hoping for any young guns I haven't received yet out of my first three hobby boxes. See what we start with. Ooh, looks like we had a young gun canvas out of a mega box. Wow, I guess we'll save that for last. Uh, I'm not sure what the odds are on those. The young gun canvases are the same as hobby, so one in every 48 packs. So I guess that'd be one in every 4.8 hobby boxes, or mega boxes, excuse me. So yeah, definitely happy with that. It looks like our second pack is going to be a superstar honor roll of Brock Nelson. And I just realized my math was wrong on that mega box. Uh, Young and canvases, definitely not one in every 4.8. I was thinking there's 10 packs when there's only nine. One in every four or so mega boxes, you'll get a Young and canvas. Okay, let's see what we got. It looks like we are first Young Guns. Let's see who we get here. That is going to be a flyer. Is that going to be... Nope, it's going to be Linus Sandine. Okay, not too familiar with him. He's wearing a, a fishbowl in his picture there. Sandine. So Sandine's one I didn't have already, so happy with that. Okay, next up. Ooh, we got a, a Blue Dazzlers. I didn't know these were in here. See what we get. And another Matt Boldy Blue Dazzlers. I actually pulled one of these out of one of our hobby boxes. I think it was the first one we actually opened. Definitely happy with that. I didn't even know you could get Blue Dazzlers out of here. So yeah, also like hobby Blue Dazzlers are one in every 24 packs. So exact same as hobby. Let's see what's up next. What is this? Oh, that's a base. And then it looks like we have... One of these rookie retrospective. This one's going to be Nico Dawes on the rookie retrospective. Okay. We got here. Looks like a debut date of Tanner Janot there. Um, he's been off to a rough start this season, I believe. I think I saw my boy Caulfield in the back. Second year Caulfield's base. Always will take those. Uh, let's see what else we get in this pack. Though. Looks like we got a Young Guns. and looks like a, a goalie have had the guess with the net there. So let's take a look here. It is a goalie, and that is going to be Eric Shelgren there. I think I do have Shelgren already, but I'll take it. Leafs goaltender. These guys, he'll have value considering Murray and Samsonov get injured quite a bit. So yeah, Shelgren, I'll take that. Actually, did just double check, and I do not have Shelgren already. So definitely happy with that now. Two young guns I didn't already have. All right, two packs to go on the first mega, and then we'll reveal our canvas. Still have a shot at getting a third young guns. Looks like we got a canvas card. This one's going to be Peyton Krebs. Oh, wow. Look at that picture on the back wearing a Flint Tropics jersey. I wonder where is that? That's so weird. Uh, interesting. And nope. Looks like we get a defense mechanism of John Carlson. All right. Let's take a look at our Young Guns canvas. Hope for a good name. 
let's see. Um, Kings? Is that? 68 Kings. Jordan Spence? Nope. Samuel Fagamo there. Uh, hopefully I'm saying that right. Uh, not too familiar. I've heard of him, but I'm not sure how to say his name. Decent prospect. All right, one mega down, one to go. All right, start off with our die cat pack. I think last time it went pretty well again, the veneers and the boldy. Hopefully, keep that luck going. Oh, we got a red on power. I guess that's a parallel. Uh, that's probably decent. Some value there. Jordan Spence, probably a weaker one. And another Manny Veneers. I'll take that. Okay, we'll start with a canvas card. This one's going to be Connor McDavid. Go one to get there. Connor McDavid. Okay, second pack up. Oh, we got a center of attention. This one's going to be Mika Sabinajad, center of attention. Third pack here. Oh, looks like we got another one of these defense mechanisms. This one's going to be of Quinn Hughes. See if you can get them here. Yep, looks like we have our first young guns. Hopefully it's, oh, I accidentally revealed it. Ben Myers there, Young Guns. I don't think I have Myers, so I'll take that. Okay, let's see. Oh, we got a Pink Dazzlers. I didn't even know you could get these out of here. They're hard hits and hobbies, so I don't even know what they'd be out of these Mega Blasters, but, or Mega Boxes. Let's see what we get here. That's gonna be a Yegor Sharangovich Pink Dazzler. So unfortunately, Probably not a ton of value there since it's Sharon Govich, but Pink Dazzlers, tough hit. I'll take it. Pink Dazzlers are one in every 144 packs in these mega boxes. So yeah, tough hit to get, but unfortunately it wasn't a better name. Let's see here. Oh, looks like we got a UD Portraits. Didn't get one of these in the last mega. This one's going to be Alexander Barkov. Okay, looks like we get a superstar honor roll. This one's going to be Kirill Kaprizov. Final two packs. So unless we get a Young Guns in both of these, probably only going to get two. We'll have to wait and see. We ain't got one in this pack, so it looks like we only got two Young Guns in each box. Get another canvas. This one's going to be a Thomas Hurdle. All right, last pack of the video. This one should have a Young Guns. Hopefully we can get something good. This second mega has not been very good besides the pink dazzlers, but even then it's only Sharon Govich. So let's see. Yep, we do have a young gun, so that's good. And it looks like Coyotes colors. Yep. Gonna be Jack McBain there. Decent prospect for the yo. It's probably not a ton of hobby value, but definitely one I don't have already. I have him in one of my dynasty fantasy leagues, so I do know about him. Uh, solid name there. I'll take it. So yeah, guys, overall, here's everything I top load. I top load every die cut except for the Spence. Um, and yeah, the Blue Dazzlers map bully is nice. And then the Young Guns, four Young Guns I didn't have. So I'm very happy with that. And then we did hit a Young Guns canvas, which was a better name. We also had a Pink Dazzlers that I didn't top load, the Igor Sharon Govich. Overall, I think these Megas, for what I paid for them, definitely worth it. But if it, I was paying the normal price of $50 plus, would not recommend these at all. So yeah, if you find them for that price, uh, like a Black Friday deal or something, thing at walmart pick them up if not i'd stay away so yeah guys hope you enjoyed uh comment down below if you want to see me open up some of the blasters when they come out and the retail boxes and tins and whatnot uh drop a like really helps me grow the channel subscribe be doing a giveaway if we reach 500 subscribers by the end of the year can't win if you're not subscribed so please can subscribe and yeah guys take care have a good one